and welcome back to my channel this is like i'm starting off my video in a car because i got a new car um it's not super brand new like it's not like a 2021 or 2022 but a 2016 nissan juke i if you didn't know i was driving a pretty big piece of crap i was driving a 2005 ford focus it had damage on the side of it it could barely accelerate past like 60 miles per hour and then it would start like shaking really bad and I was like limited on where I could go. I finally was able to get a better car and yeah it's not brand new but it's still newer than what I had. I was driving a 2005 and I'm very grateful. Um, I did do chapter 7 bankruptcy um, last year and so I had to get something a little bit older not like too old but like a five six years or newer is like the policy after you do bankruptcy so i got a little bit of a little bit older of a car just because interest rates are very high on bankrupt bankruptcy auto loans so i kind of wanted to stay in like the 15 to twenty thousand range i got this car i'm very grateful that i was able to get something because my car that I had was not safe. It barely, like I said, barely could accelerate. It, The knobs fell off to the heater. And it just wasn't a car that was, that was practical. It was a piece of junk. So I'm going to stop talking and I'm going to give you guys a little bit of a car tour. So this is the outside. This is like the front of it. And then if you go over here, this is what, kind of what it looks like the doors has like these little handles on the top which is kind of cool it was like my veloster had these handles so I thought it was cool this is the back of it so yeah it's it's pretty nice I really like it it says juke right there and then this is the other side of the car this is the inside this is the steering wheel this does this is a cover they like left on the previous owner's steering wheel cover for some reason but yeah this is the front seat this is kind of what it looks like it has a little screen um it is not fully touch screen i don't think it's touch screen at all but that's really not my concern this is the shift knob right here and it has plugs for your phone and auxiliary this here's the emergency brake the cup holders and then it has like this little area for storage it's magnet see magnets which is a nice this is the interior I have like a pen and then this is this part and then this just opens right here it has like the manual everything and then the vents open like this they like open and shut like this which is cool the handles are really cool this is the other door it has like the locks, the window thing where you roll down the windows, and then the other vent as well. And then this is the steering wheel close up, and then these are the gauges. This is back here. The door is kind of small. It's kind of cute and small. There's a little cup holder right there. Oh, this is Casey's juice. I bought like, juice from the dollar store. And then if you go back here, it's um, pretty spacious. I mean, it is small, but it is really spacious. This is Kaysen's car seat. Um, it's in here. His car seat needs to be washed. Then this is the back. I have a box of things that were in my other car. These are like the headrests. There's no storage, but that's fine. Um, and this, I don't know what this is for. Oh. And then there's also this. I don't, I don't know what the point of that is. But I need to detail this car a little better. And then it has a middle seat. And then this is the other side. The windows are pretty small, but I kind of like it. It's cute. And then, this is the trunk. It's a little trunk space. There's a box of stuff that was in my other car. And the other license plate. And then under here, let's see. Under here, just has like extra storage. Looks like it has jumper cables in there or something. This is where the gas cap is. The rims are pretty nice. <clears throat> I do want to paint those black though. 
like Plasti dip these black just to give it more of a of a look to it. And then these are the headlights. And again, this is the front of it. Forgot to mention, it is also a push start, which I've never had before. So, yeah, I that I love that about this. And then these are the other vents. I do want to get some things, some more decorations for my car that are like more me. And I definitely want to get rid of this. I don't like it. That's pretty much the quick little video. This is like a last minute video, but I love the car. It has a turbo in it, so I love that. I love that. It was so tempting to speed. It's kind of a bad thing because it really tempts me to speed, so I have to try to not speed. But when I do do the Plasti Dip Accents, I will definitely do a video on that. I did it on my Veloster, but it was a really stupid color like I chose a really stupid color so this time I'm going to plasti dip my rims black not blue that was a mistake and just to give it like a little bit of accent you guys are wanting like a little car that's like not super expensive but super cute and practical I definitely recommend this car it speeds up really well it's very fast and I love it I'll definitely do like update on the car in like a month or so just so you guys know how it's been doing. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.